Session Viewer is a visualization tool that supports exploratory analysis of web session logs. We will illustrate the use of Session Viewer with a real-life example. Here, we have loaded two session populations from a user study. On the left is the watch population, where the participants were asked to find a water-resistant watch for under $100. On the right is the camera population, where the participants were asked to find the pixel resolution of the Nikon Coolpix 4600. Even though both are commercial tasks, the behaviors look very different. We will take a closer look of the two populations. In the sessions panel, events of each session are displayed in a single vertical column as shown as colored rectangular boxes. The first events are at the top and the last events are at the bottom. The color of the boxes show the type of event. In this example, green boxes are search events, blue boxes are next page events, and red boxes are results clicks. To better see the event count distribution, we reorder the sessions by the attribute number of events. Once sorted, we can compare the two populations. We see that the camera task seems to require fewer events than the watch task. A closer look shows that the camera task has more sessions with two or fewer events, each with a single green search event. Is it possible that people have very different patterns of behavior in these two cases? To find out, we use the Event Pattern Searcher in Session Viewer. We first define the short navigation pattern, which is a search event followed by a non-search engine event. We highlight all the matches with a yellow color. We easily see that the camera task sessions has more yellow highlighting than the watch sessions. To compare, we define and highlight another pattern, which starts with a search event followed by a series of non-search engine events, suggesting a more exploratory search. We highlight these matches in a cyan color. This suggests that the searches in the watch population is more exploratory than those in the camera population. To see what our participants were doing in the longer sessions in the exploratory watch population, we look at sessions with large number of events. We can see that many of the events are not search engine events. These are gray boxes. To see the search structure, we expand one of the sessions. When expanded, each unique web page is in its own column. For example, these green boxes show the same search engine results page event. Here, we see two distinct search patterns, diagonal rows of gray boxes and vertical rows of boxes, both in gray and green. In summary, Session Viewer helps us compare between session populations by looking at distributions based on session attributes. We characterize populations by using event sequence patterns and then visually estimating the prevalence of these patterns. To further understand these patterns, we selectively study interesting sessions in detail. Session Viewer helps our selection by allowing session reordering based on attributes so that we can easily locate interesting outliers in a population.